this one I've heard of, but have not played. So I don't know how that's going to go. Why are you in that? There we go. So hopefully I can get a game that I can actually play for like a half an hour, because all of them have been like 10 minute one shots of eh. Which I know PlayStation had enough sh shovelware generic titles. Oh, uh, Psygnosis. Always known for Demolition Derby. Yeah, I don't think you're getting a perfect 10. A giant spaceship turtle? Kinda neat. It's like Dungeons and Dragons plus um, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Is it going to unfold? It's not how you summon a dragon. Why didn't they put the voice as a music track and just put it on audio sync? Because the sharp cutout is terrible. Music is like ripped straight out of like Genesis. This is a point and click. Point and click on consoles. I'll see you again next week for my usual special. Hi, what's where you going? See you soon. You had a brush with death. Getting to a point. Ah, hands up. Who's there? Hands. Would you mind putting your hands up? Why? What's happening? It's a simple courtesy. I say, put your hands up. And you, put your hands up. What did you say? It's traditional. A well established ritual. Of your actual mugger and victim relationship. You be the victim and me be the aforementioned mugger. Now please put your hands up. Hold on to you, what's the names? <laughs> I haven't got all night, you know. Just do it, all right. Okay, okay. I don't know what this town is coming to. A man can't even have a quiet drink in peace. Okay. This is like a like a bad YouTube animation. Oh 
Okay. Unseen University. The home of the greatest wizards on the Discworld. And I was wondering when Discworld would come into play. <clears throat> This really is like budget by PC garbage. As for the who, well, I know of the ideal person. Why don't you go and fetch Rincewind for me? Where it's like they have all this like long cutscene that's supposed to be like interesting and get you wrapped in the story, and then the gameplay is just like absolute garbage. And I get a feeling that this game is just going to like become something else, be like a series of mini games, or like this point and click adventure that's like non sequitur and timed. Here's our hero, quote unquote. He's so wacky. Rincewind, Rincewind, wake up! The Arch Chancellor wants to see you. Oh my God! You have to control the D-pad. Michael Palin. No, I can't shift it. A snoring chest, that's novel. Well, I'll soon fix that. Was I so like a dragon? Literally right there. That doesn't work. That doesn't work. Oh, okay. The cursor really can't decide what it's doing. I mean, plus one for Michael Palin, but... Okay, so cir circles the look button. Ugh, you can't just like put things directly in your inventory. Okay, so squares inventory. I really must do some heavy research into this bed. Eight or nine solid hours should be sufficient. Try like twelve. Twelve to thirteen is a good amount of sleep. A snoring chest. That's okay. Yeah, you already said that. Shut up. Okay, so triangle is used. It would be nice if they at least, like, put something up. Uh, this, I'm trying out this game called Discworld. It's rather... It, it has this, like, budget by PC game kind of thing going on for it. 
So how do I how do I walk? There we go. <clears throat> so apparently square does that. But apparently it's a PlayStation 1 point and click. I don't really know how much of it I'm actually going to play. Cuz this is pretty awful to control. Is there any Oh jeez. Well, there we go. Ugh. Okay, walk, action, examine. But earlier it opened up my inventory. Confusing. Okay. Ugh. Uh. How, how do I get out of this menu? Ugh. How do I get out? Oh, thank you. Jesus Christ. At least this isn't like King's Quest, where if you screw up clicking, you end up dead. On stairs, that is. The lethal stairs of King's Quest. Okay, what's this? There's teeth marks all over this one. Must be the dining room. What? Now you're giving me a whole like host of options. Another busy day in the faculty, gentlemen. We are cogitating. I hope I heard that right. Said in a knowing tone of voice, nudge nudge. Cogitating, my lad, is that process by which the wise make space inside their minds for more ideas. You make more space for ideas by sitting on your backside, sipping a cup of milky tea. Hit him. Hit him. My boy, ideas are normally sold by volume, not by weight. It's best to let them settle so you can find more room in the top. We have wisdom and you do not. For okay. Instance, this is the action of a clever man. Okay, that's enough. Wisdom, my lad, is never cheap. Okay, this game is dreadful. It it's one of those games that is like that cringy budget buy. They got one celebrity to voice it, and that's it. Like when I worked at Staples, and when I worked at uh, um. Circuit City, we had a whole rack of these type of games where it's like a point and click or like a, a walking adventure novel, and they all had like start featuring voices by celebrity guests, and it's always like just the main character, and the entire games are like all like five dollars, and they're all just just really bad, and I have to say that this one so far has not found any anything to really ground it as like an interesting point and click like uh, uh, growing up with king's quest and all sorts of like interesting point and clicks and even other point and clicks that came out on playstation that i've played this one just first off it looks like a sega genesis game like a sega cd game and it's just the voice acting and the sound is terrible like the design and world is bad like no no thank you this is like pretty much the worst of point and clicks games that are stylized like this and that proceed like this like i've never been a monkey island fan and i never understood the appeal of monkey island even though i've played them but this is like right in that same category so i guess if you like monkey island this would be good but otherwise, I think this is pretty much just garbage. Not not really great. Also, the controls are all over the place. So, yeah, that's enough of this one.